A push to get global internet giants to take down extremist propaganda is part of the UK's new plan to crack down on terrorism. Theresa May joined a growing chorus of leaders and experts calling for more to be done to prevent another attack. Phoebe Bowden reports. We've seen this far too many times now. And things are clearly about to change. We cannot and must not pretend that things can continue as they are. There is, to be frank, far too much tolerance of extremism in our country. The pressure is mounting on our Prime Minister to do more too. Former PM Tony Abbott wants the military to take the lead with greater power to shoot to kill. If it is a complex terrorist incident, uh, as soon as possible, uh, the military need to be involved. But many believe the problem still starts at our borders. Bob Catter wants all immigration from the Middle East and North Africa stopped. Anyone that says that we should be bringing them in, then let him bear the blame because you know that a percentage of those people you bring in will cause this trouble. But former Foreign Minister Kim Beasley warns any radical responses will only make things worse. To wander around insulting Islam is dumb on a stick. Anti-terrorism experts agree with Theresa May that we must do better, especially preventing radicalisation. The government will say that they're getting have successes, but I've also heard uh, certainly through, uh, through uh, some psychologists and through um, uh, people on the periphery of those programs that they're failing. The internet is also copying plenty of blame. Companies such as Google, Facebook and Twitter are being urged to take down extremist propaganda. We cannot allow this ideology the safe space it needs to breed. Yet that is precisely what the internet and the big companies that provide internet-based services provide. The UK's Prime Minister wants to see international agreements put in place to disrupt extremists who plan attacks online. And our Prime Minister agrees that cracking down on terrorists using cyberspace is key. There are no borders. Nowhere is far away, away from anywhere else in the age of the internet. How to rid the world of terrorism was discussed at high-level security talks today with US Defence Secretary James Mattis and Secretary of State Rex Tillerson. Clearly the enemy has got to be taken out. Enough is enough. Phoebe Bowden, Telewitness News.